Hello everyone welcome back to another video, guys today's video is going to be amazing for all the gamers, but guys before moving on this video, make sure to like on this video, and if you are new, then subscribe my channel and press the bell icon for more amazing videos, so guys let's talk about today videos file, guys today I'm again bought you a brand new gaming optimizer for your Android phone, and this app is same as Vexero Magis Manager, which I had posted a video few days ago. And this is also same like that, or you can call it a light version of Vexero Magis Manager, but the name of this optimizer is different, and the name of this optimizer is Sunprop Magisk Manager, which is developer by Endrich, so all the credit goes to him, and keep it up bro, although this optimizer is not stable, and some features doesn't work, however I'm sharing it because, after using don't forget the comment your feedback, about this optimizer, later in video I will explain about its features, so keep watching the video, so guys if you also want to try this optimizer on your phone, and want to use some new features and modules file, then all the links are provided, simply, download and follow my steps, to avoid any mistakes, ok guys now let's move on to applying process, please watch full video, so guys without wasting more time, let's get start the video. Ok so guys first of all download the file from the given link, name as Sunprop Magisk Manager, after download extract the file, and here you will get, Magisk modules for Sunprot application, and Suprot optimizer apk, guys this newly created optimizer, so you will get only few modules, but if this will get good response, then more modules will come for you in next update, right now, only 3 module is provided, which is, rendering layer, frame optimizer, and thermal control, so I will, tell later, for to use these modules in your phone, right now we will install the sunprop manager, so let's install the app, when installation process will be completed, tap in done, because if you try to open, it will not work until you allow the Suzuku permission, you can see here Suzuku is not active, so let open and run Suzuku application, guys you can download the Suzuku application from the given link, and you can run it with the help of, whilst debugging, ADB and OTG, and also with the help of laptop or PC, I have provided the link that how you can use Suzuku and prevent with the help of ADB and OTG. You can watch that tutorial if your phone doesn't support wireless debugging option, ok. Guys now Suzuku starts running, after this again relaunch the Sunprot optimizer, then here allow the Shizuku permission, now you can access the Sunprot optimizer on your phone, and guys this is the interface of this newly launched Sunprot optimizer which looks like Vexero Magisk Manager, or you can call it, a light version of Vexero. So let's explore what features has been added in this this optimizer. First let's see in toolset option, guys here you can see, some features has been provided, like, permission, command, resolution changer, GFX tools, battery changer, auto brightness, an uninstall or disable application. First let's check what is this for, guys really don't understand this about permission, and what is the use of this feature, for now skip this feature. And let's move on to another features, which is command, so guys basically this is kind of prevent application, by which you can execute the command, next features is resolution changer, guys this feature is useful only for those whose phone is running, in Android 9, 10 and 11, but if your phone is above these, please don't use this feature, otherwise your phone may crash or you have to factory reset, because changing resolution is not safe for all devices, so use it at your own risk, but I highly suggest to not use this feature on your phone, our next features is GFX tools, so let's check out, ok so here it's asking to add package name of game, so guys let me show you, how you will get the game package name, to get the package name, just, go to internal storage, then here search for android folder, then data folder, and these are the package name of all apps and games, you can simply copy the package name from here, then paste in sunprot application, after pasting, here some more tweaks is added, like, you can type the rendering layer, you can type here, open GL, Skia GL, and Vulkan GL, any rendering layer you want just type, next tweaks is scale resolution factor, so guys, I don't have any idea about this, and I request a developer at least provide the description of each tweaks and features so, users and read and use that features, so leave this tweak, let move to another tweak, which is FPS, here you can type FPS which your phone, support, dot and type over FPS, otherwise your FPS may decrease, now simply tap in apply, well it's not working grinning face, 
Let me try to apply another game package name. It's also not working. I don't know what is the problem here. Developer if you are watching this, please fix this issue in your next update. So guys it's not working, so don't try this also to waste your time. Now let's see other features, which is battery changer. And guys this also not usable for your Android phones, so skip this features also. Next features is frame rate. Here it's saying that you can type FPS up to 300. So here I will type 60, then apply. Guys I don't know whether it's applied or not, because I did not get any notification after applying the FPS. Guys most of features are not working and some features are not usable in this section. But if you want to try then try this out. Now we will move on to another features which is Sunprop module. As I already told you, that you will get only 3 module in this update. To apply the module, do this steps. Before flashing the module, just go to internal storage, then go to extracted folder. Now here simply copy Sunprot, folder, then paste it in internal storage, and that's all. Now you are all set to flash the module. Next again go back to the Sunprot Magis Manager. Then install module section. Now here locate the Sunprot folder, which we has pasted recently. Then here select which module you want to flash. Simply select then flash, as you can see here that the module has been flashed successfully. If you want to apply other module also, then repeat the same process. So guys this was the tutorial and applying process of Sunprot Magisk Manager, and if you want to delete or remove the file, then execute the uninstall the module, then clear the data of Sunprot, after these simply restart your phone, all the files will be removed from your phone. Guys now you can try this Magisk Manager application on your phone, and let me know in the comment section, that how it's working, because it, will be more helpful for developer so he can optimize and fix error in next update, so don't forget to comment your valuable feedback, guys I hope you like this video, and if my videos are informative, then kindly, like, share and subscribe for more amazing videos, related to your games and devices, so guys that's all for today, see you in next video, till then take care and sign in out.